in this tutorial we would be learning about b model but before that we have to understand what was the problem with software development life cycle model as a result of which this model evolved now let us understand with the help of an example suppose we are making a very complex project where the requirement is not clear to the development team and the outcome of the project was software product that were not matching client's requirement there may be a problem which could lead to a product defective product as outcome which is not as per expectation of the client there may be problem in design analysis phase requirement gathering or other phase phases of software development life cycle so it is important to validate that all the phases of software development life cycle are correct and fulfilling the requirement that each phase of software development life cycle is meant for only because of this disadvantage of sdlc which is very big disadvantage there was emergence of new model called v model also if there is change in the requirement and the change in in requirement is detected at later stage of software development life cycle then there is lot of effort required to develop expected product which in turn increases the cost input of the project which is very unexpected and unwanted condition for any organization based on all this information we can say that earlier the defect is detected lesser is the cost incurred to sort out the issue at the earliest during software development life cycle therefore testing is requirement testing is required in all the phases of software development life cycle starting from requirement gathering to the last phase of software development life cycle so that any issue that is detected there in the software development life cycle is detected at the earliest and in turn eliminating the issue at the earliest as a result of which there is cost saving as well as prevention of unnecessary extra effort in software development which ultimately leads to happy customer let us see how the v model looks like both verification and validation are important process that needs to be followed to get up quality to get quality product for the customer and has to be followed sincerely in order to avoid any unwanted condition in this view model we can see both validation and valid, both verification and validation is going side by side which is very important for developing quality software application or software product now let us see detailed analysis of v model we can clearly see that first stage of software development life cycle is requirement gathering and analysis and we can clearly see that requirement analysis is there 
corresponding to which user acceptance testing is done which is generally done in presence of client to see that the software project has met all the requirements given by customer or client next is functional specification where all requirements are mapped to functions corresponding to which system testing is done system testing is done in order to test all the functionalities of the application next is high level design which is generally done in design phase of software development life cycle corresponding to which integration testing is done and where related modules are integrated and tested in order to test whether all the modules are able to interact with each other properly or not next comes detailed design program corresponding to which unit testing is done it is done at very low level where we can concentrate on a smallest unit of the application we check the requirement at lowest level through unit testing next comes coding and implementation which comes in later stage of software development life cycle and all types of testing system system testing unit testing integration testing user acceptance testing and system testing is done after coding and implementation so we can clearly see that on the left hand side of the diagram we are having the stages of software development life cycle which is focused more on the development of the application and is focused on whether we are making a product in a proper way following all the standard procedures of software development life cycle and on the right side of the diagram we are doing validation of what we are doing in software development life cycle stage and, and ensuring that what we are doing in, in different stages of software development life cycle are correct and as per expectation of the customers 